Hello friends, I'm Parwaiz and this is our 15th video in PyQt5 GUI development. In this video, we're going to create an example of QColor dialog and also QFont font dialog in PyQt5. So the QColor dialog is used for changing the color of the, for example, if you have a text edit and uh, you have some texts in the text edit and you can you want to change the color, uh, then you can use the QColor dialog and uh, QFont dialog is used for uh, changing the font of a text. Now, this is my Qt designer and I'm going to uh, create a simple design. So basically a text edit with two Q push buttons. And uh, let me just click on create. So I'm using Q widget. And in here, the first thing I need, I'm going to add a, uh, so you can add anything you want, but I want to add a vertical layout. Okay, now after this, I need to just add a horizontal layout in here. In the vertical layout, we need to add a Q text edit. So, a uh, text edit. <coughs> and uh, in the horizontal layout, we need to add two Q push button. One for color dialog, and the second one is for the font dialog. So this is my first button and this is my second button. I uh, change the title of first one to, for example, a color dialog or we can say uh, change color. And this is for changing the font. Uh, also, we need to change the object name. So the first one is uh, uh, Q push button color, and the second one is push button uh, font. And also, you need to choose your main a window and make the layout vertically. So now we have a nice layout. Uh, after this, you need to save this, and I'm going to just save this, and uh, you can call it whatever you want. For example, I'm going to call it uh, color, color d.ui. Now we want to convert our UI file to Python file, so I'm going to just open my uh, where the I'm going to open the installation of my Python. And uh, from here, you need to uh, find scripts folder. This is the scripts folder. And in here, you need to copy the UI file because we are using PyYUAC5 uh, module for converting the .UI file to Python file. Now, in here, you can see that this is PyYUAC5 and this is our UI file. And we can just open our terminal in here. So open in terminal and this is our terminal so you can see it's at the location as a scripts folder. Now in here you can just say pyuac5 uh, give the name of your UI file and after that you can just give it for example a color dialog.py so it's the output and hit enter and now if you see the scripts folder you will see that it's converted and you can see color dialog.py and we can cut this and bring this in my working directory and paste it in here and we can find this color dialog.py Okay, now this is our converted file and let me just run this. Uh, so you can see we have a text edit and also we have two buttons. Now we need to first create for the change color. So first we need to import from pyqt5.qt widgets. We want to import Q color dialog. 
and also Q phone dialog. So now let's create our method in here. I'm going to just call it a color dialog. So first we need to get the color from the Q color dialog. So dot get color and after that we can set the color to the text edit so self dot text edit dot set color set text color and we want to add color in here okay now uh, so let me just okay now uh, we have our color dialog it's time to connect this with the uh, push button color so we can just say self dot push button color dot clicked dot connect and we want to connect the color dialog okay now if I write something for example I'm writing in wrong place so let me run this again okay now I'm going to write hello world how are you and we can change the color from here you can see we have a nice color dialog and now you can see the color is changed so now let's just create the font dialog also the font dialog and we can just create font ok so the first thing we need we need to get the font so get font and after that we are going to check if ok we want to set self dot text edit dot set font and we want to add the font in here and now we need to connect this with the button so with the push button font self dot push button font dot click dot connect and it is self dot font dialog Okay, now if I write hello world, change font, bold, and you can see the font is changed, and also you can uh, change the color like this. So, thank you guys. If you want the source code, you can just check the video description or you can check my blog geekscoders.com and you can get the source code.